morning friends today topic is AIGF DG shipping exit exam question and answer part 1 question number 1 an intrinsically safe circuits use an IS barrier this consists of option A circuit breaker of high fault current option B circuit breaker of low fault current option C fuses option D xeno diodes and fuses IS barrier is intrinsically safe barrier what is this IS barrier IS barrier is a one protect equipment from surges in the current that would otherwise risk turning the equipment into an ignition source so this will protect the equipment in order to prevent to blow off or give off the heat energy which will be sufficient to cause ignition source this is what IS barriers do so IS barrier consists of what that is the first question answer is D xeno diodes and fuses. Question number two. Slow speed dual fuel engines uses option A. Low pressure gas. Option B high pressure gas. Option C MEGI uses high pressure and BIN GT XTF uses low pressure gas. Option D. They can change from to high pressure as per load. So dual fuel engine is he is talking about the main engine. So which we they use fuel oil and they use gas oil. That is gas, LNG gas. So slow speed engine. What we are using? The correct answer is option C. MEGI uses high pressure and Minjit XTF uses low pressure gas. So here gas pressure is around 10 bar. And here gas pressure is around 250 to 300 bar. Question number 3. After discharging the liquid from the cardboard tank, a small quantity will be remaining and it will be difficult to pump it out. This small quantity of liquid is called as option A, liquid trap, option B, heel, option C, mold, option D, none. That is unpumpable LNG. Answer is heel. Question number 4. Select the correct statement. Option A. The high pressure method of gas injection is generally used in 4 stroke trunk piston type engines used as a power generating engine. Option B. The high pressure method of gas injection is generally not used in 4 stroke trunk piston type engine. Those are not used as power generating engine. Option C, the low pressure method of gas injection is generally used in four-stroke trunk piston type engine used as power generating engine. Option D, the low pressure method of gas injection is generally not used in four-stroke trunk piston type engine used as a power generating engine. The correct statement is, the low pressure method of gas injection is generally used in four-stroke engine used as a power generating engine they are telling generators on board generators we are using low pressure method high pressure method or we are using only in main engine question number five in relation to a ship's boiler identify an incorrect statement option a the furnace of a d type water tube boiler must always be outside the shell Option B, fire tube tank boilers consist of a shell with tubes fitted inside it. Option C, water tube boilers usually consist of a drum with tubes fitted on the outside and leads to headers and the water drum. Option D, the furnace of a tank type fire tube boilers can either be inside or outside the cell. So, incorrect statement is furnace furnace of a tank type 5 tube boiler can either be inside or outside the shell. 
this is not relevant it has to be inside the shell of the boiler then only it will transfer the heat energy question number six select the correct statement option a to obtain the op optimum air fuel ratio in fuel load operating condition the quantity of air must be adjusted by controlling the turbocharger speed as well as adjusting the flow of gas fuel option b to obtain the optimum air fuel ratio in part load operating condition the quantity of air must be adjusted by controlling the turbocharger speed as well as adjusting the flow of gas fuel option c to obtain the optimum air fuel ratio in any operating condition the quantity of air must be adjusted by controlling the turbocharger speed as well as adjusting the flow of gas fuel option d to obtain the optimum air fuel ratio in slow speed condition the quantity of air must be adjusted by controlling the turbocharger speed as well as adjusting the flow of gas fuel the correct answer is option c to obtain the optimum air fuel ratio in any operating condition you are using part load full load slow speed here or any operating condition any load you can adjust that is the correct answer question number 7 the tanks machineries and pipelines of lng are subjected to process of das to establish non flammable condition option a inserting option b inerting option c injecting the correct answer is option b inerting so inerting is the only method helps to keep the tank machinery pipeline away from the flammable range if air is come into contact they may the fuel or vapor fuel vapor will come in contact in the flammable range criteria so it has to be avoided by inerting operation question number eight acceleration force is to the direction of fluid flow and the direction of mechanical rotation option a parallel option b opposite option c perpendicular the correct answer is perpendicular the direction of fluid flow is perpendicular to the direction of mechanical rotation then the then only the acceleration force is created thrust force is created question number nine select the correct statement option a when operation is performed in the gas mode for a period exceeding 10 minutes at a load below 15 percentage the gas mode trips automatically and change over the diesel mode option b when operation is performed in the gas mode for a period exceeding 15 minutes at a load below 15 percentage the gas mode trips automatically and change over the diesel mode option c in the operating operation is performed in the gas mode for a period exceeding three minute at a load below 15 min percentage the gas mode trips automatically and change over the diesel mode option d an operation is performed in the gas mode for period exceeding 20 minutes at a load below 15 percentage the gas mode trips automatically and change over the diesel mode the correct answer is option C so it is for a period exceeding 3 minutes so all the symptoms 3 minutes is a different and load below 15 percentage the gas mode trips automatically and change out for the diesel mode now in man engine the this occurs so the yeah, fuel mode to gas mode occurs more than 10 percentage of MCR load okay this is a new invention done by the man engine to achieve more than 10 percentage of the load it we can use gas question number 10 presence of gas content in the tank atmosphere is sampled before starting the gassing up operation option a nitrogen option b oxygen option c carbon answer is option b oxygen we are inerting by nitrogen but we are not checking the nitrogen we are checking the oxygen content our aim is to reduce the oxygen content below its flammable range question number 11 during bunkering 
an area of sufficient size that keep of the vessels equipment and cargo operation far enough away that they pose little risk of damaging or interfering with the LNG bunkering system such an area is designated as option A safety zone option B security zone option C hazardous area option D ISPS border the correct answer is security zone this area is called as security zone question number 12 in overflow control what will be an additional sensor operating independently of the high liquid level alarm do option a automatically actuate a switch on valve option b automatically activate esd including loading valve emergency shutdown option c manually actuate actuate a shut off valve option d manually actuate a switch on valve so if it is in overflow control what is the safety measure there is a high level alarm is there and the radar cage is continuously checking the level and give the alarm but what is the artisan safety the correct answer is automatically actuate a esd so it will actuate the emergency shutdown device it will not only shut down the palms and walls in the ship side it also do on the other ship the bunker barge which is supplying or it's from the shore it's from the shore walls also shut through the ship shore link so this is the correct answer question number 13 the bunkering system shall be so arranged option a no leakage take place option b no gas is discharged to the atmosphere during filling of storage tank option c the bunkering system withstand fluctuation in loading pressure option d the bunkering system withstand fluctuation in ambient temperature answer is no leakage take place that is our primary aim question number 14 the duct should also be pressure tested to should it can withstand the expected dash at gas pipe rub and option at least pressure option b lower pressure option c maximum pressure option d minimum pressure in double valve pipe outside of between the duct area from inner pipe to outer pipe the duct area has to be pressure tested to what pressure answer is option c maximum pressure this double wall pipe is be made in the hazardous area which of the area there is hazardous area zone 0 it has to be double wall pipe zone 0 and zone 1 area question number 15 what is the danger of lng spill from any flange connection during bunkering option a massive explosion at the connection area option b breakout of fire at connection area option c cold embrittlement fracture of steel depleting below the connection option d formation of huge vapor cloud around the connection area answer is option c cold embrittlement fracture of steel depleting below the connection area this is what happened because your lng fuel is minus 161 degrees celsius when it is come into contact with your men ships hull structures which is cannot withstand this low temperature this will go to brittle fracture that's why below the connection point we always have a deep tray the deep tray is made for stainless steel which can withstand this temperature question number 16 fuel preparation room comprises of which equipment option a hp vaporizer option b oil of gas compressor option c glycol skid option d all of the above the correct answer is all of the above fuel preparation room fprs which is on the deck mostly it will be in between your bunker tank lng bunker tank that fuel preparation room which is consist of your lp compressor hp compressor lp your hp pump your uh, glycol pump glycol system everything will be inside the room okay question number 17 critical pressure of ethanol is option a 
61.5 bar absolute option b 30 bar absolute option c 60 bar option d none of the above the correct answer is option a 61.5 bar absolute is the critical pressure of ethanol option question number 18 weathering of lng refers to option a contamination of lng by water option b polymerization of lng option c change of lng composition due to vapor formation option d solidification of lng what is weathering answer is change of lng composition due to vapor formation so lng composition changes with respect to vapor formation as we say the lower carbon lower carbon content in the liquid will go to vapor state very easily light in weight so whatever is the lng first you get is ethane ch4 methane first you get methane then you get ethane then you get propane so the heal amount of lng mostly consists of propane compounds okay question number 19 natural gas in liquid state may be stored in tank with a mrv s of that is master allow max sorry maximum allowable relief valve setting this is a maximum allowable relief valve setting of relief valve on the lng tank system option a 1 bar option b 10 bar option c 8 bar option d 16 bar the correct answer is option b 10 bar question number 20 statements on the fire detection system are listed identify one that is not that is incorrect option a the power supply should be from the normal supply and from an emergency source option b the detection system should be operate, operatable at all times option c the detection should be self monitor any fault or failure of the equipment option d all the detection system may not be self-monitoring for failure. Correct answer is all the detection system may not be self-monitoring for failure. So we can that's why we cannot this is an incorrect statement. So that's why I'm telling fire detection system is we are using human shift because it is a self-monitoring type called continuously works. Okay friends, thank you. And I like to inform you, I already put plenty videos in BAGF course. So for uh, BAGF videos, you can go through this BAGF video, which is also having the questions of AGF. So questions which are asking from BAGF on AGF, I am not repeating here. So you have to refer to a BAGF course. And thanks for watching my video. If you like, you can like. If you want to see more video related to this you can subscribe my channel and any doubts any comments always welcome in comment box thank you